what we're trying to understand is the connection between individual, uh, the molecular mechanisms that control individual vulnerability or resilience to the effects of stress and how those mechanisms can be translated into novel treatments. And uh, I think we're, we're making good progress that it is taking us in, in interesting directions, uniting uh, molecular genetics, brain imaging, and psychopharmacology, uh, and these sorts of interdisciplinary uh, team science approaches to solving this very complicated problem of PTSD, I think is a, is a very good path. I would say that in parallel that we're very excited by some of the most basic and molecular neuroscience which are opening up yet new ideas about how uh, the brain responds to stress, uh, unexpected mechanisms that will take us in yet new, newer and even more important uh, directions. So both at the very basic levels and in the translational research, I think we're heading into a very exciting time for post-traumatic stress disorder research.